many years back, how can you believe in what you are now? Imagine when I was uh, eight years old in the countryside. Uh, nobody. I dream like a big athlete. When I run, I'm going to the forest. Maybe some days I'm going to a big stadium. I run, maybe I'm going to gold medals. I dream like that. Just everybody wants to run because they know many, many uh, great runners we have. And so just they want to be like them. Most students, when they go to school, you know, they go walking to school. So they have that kind of natural reason to running. The athletes, they don't have at food, clothes, uh, everybody coming for the poor uh, family. Uh, because of that, uh, for Ethiopians, uh, good uh, to be run. Running is special uh, in Ethiopia because uh, we achieved many uh, results from Olympic uh, World Championship. Running here is a, it's like a, a culture. If you ask me, you know, just how many Ethiopians are running here in this country? Uh, not a thousand, maybe a million. A day without running is not a day. <laughs> Since a baby Bikila won 50 years ago, people have been really interested in running and are so emotional about athletics. Then we came along, a new generation, which has really captured the imagination of the people. It's a kind of an inspiration for the young generation. Uh, Haile is like Beckham in the UK. Hi, how are you doing? They follow the footsteps of Ali Gavisad. It's wonderful. Uh, I'm so proud. <laughs> I feel happy because uh, I am lucky woman for Ethiopia. Uh, because in Ethiopia, too many women they don't have opportunity to learn, to run, to do everything. In Ethiopia, the women and men not the same level. Uh, God uh, give me this opportunity. I'm happy with my successes and it puts me in a good position where I must achieve good results so I can be a good role model and it keeps me on my toes. People in the, you know, in the Western world uh, don't have the true image of our country. Many years back, uh, drought, uh, war and a lot of problems, but now it's different. Here in Addis Ababa especially, you can see everywhere there's a construction. This is the you know, other side of Ethiopia. We have to educate more people, more kids to school. We can, we can see a different Ethiopia. Winning the Olympics or the World Championship and having a flag, um, you know, while all the world is represented is a main thing. In Ethiopia, if we didn't take a gold medal, the silver is nothing. We run only for gold. When we win Olympics and World Championship, the next day all the roads runners, too many runners, small children, big uh, women, everybody running. This is Alan Fitness Center. This is where, where I am training every day in the afternoon, where I am mastered. Why I'm still competing? Because I need to sweat. This treadmill, it, it goes up to 25 kilometers per hour. The world record treadmill. We check, you know, what, uh, what will be, you know, the new generation and the old generation. Uh, it's a good for comparison, how far I am, you know, from the new generation. I don't think uh, this new generation will challenge highly easily. <laughs>